I want to show you a quick tutorial in Lightroom 3 to create an image that looks like this and turn it into an image that looks like this. Um, it's a little bit of a vintage style look um, and I will show you step by step how to get there. What we're going to do first is uh, go into our color settings here and bump this up to 9000. It's going to look a little bit um, washed with yellow. Um, you definitely want that. Um, when you start um, and you can kind of bump it around um, to kind of catch that color that you want. Um, I'm going to pull my exposure down just a little bit here, um, maybe half a step or whatever that is, uh, half, minus 0 0.5 or 0.45. Um, what I usually like to do too is come up to here and see if there's any overblown whites and go to my recovery and um, when you click this it'll, it'll highlight those for you. Um, you can go to your recovery and kind of take some of those out. Um, I usually don't take all of them out because it kind of starts doing stuff to the lights in the photo as well. Um, so I'm going to unclick that, it'll get rid of that. Um, I still want some highlight, but um, and that should be fine. So I'm going to bust a little fill in here, and give it a, a little bit of a, a nice uh, fill light to get rid of some of those darker shadows. The, the blacks I'm not going to mess with too much. Um, bump it, or actually I'm going to come down with my uh, bright, oh, you know what, go up with my brightness here a little bit, and uh, my contrast as well, uh, just to make it, almost give it, gives it a little bit sharper look when you bump your uh, your contrast. Also, I'm going to bump my clarity just a tiny bit and get rid of some color here. Um, this is where the yellow is going to kind of disappear, I'm only going to go down a tiny bit here usually only about that much on both saturation and uh, um, see how that softens that yellow uh, look. So we kind of are coming to close to a finish here. Um, what I'd like to do, um, I, let me see if I can find something uh, to kind of demonstrate what I'm going to talk to you about next. Um, I'm going to highlight, kind of see how this uh, magenta um, is kind of surrounding the uh, whites in the image. Well, um, there's a, a cool way to get rid of that is just going to your color mapping here and you can kind of um, get, you should select all of your um, lighter magenta style colors kind of you can pull them into like a, a white and then unsaturate them um, that you'll see you'll notice that if I hit control Z here you're gonna see right in here some of that magenta come back and now disappear again um, when I do this um, I do that with usually these three colors, unless it affects my photo um, a whole bunch, and usually it doesn't, so I think we're good with this. Um, and now I kind of got rid of that, uh, that hue around the photo here. Um, now um, I'll go ahead and zoom back out, I kind of neutralized the edges of the, the, uh, the whites there. Um, and then sometimes I'll throw a little bit of a vignette. Um, this photo doesn't really need a whole lot of uh, noise reduction. Um, it's a pretty decent picture. It's not too sharp. I might bump the sharpness just a tad here. Get some uh, some crisp um, eyelashes and things like that detail. Um, and then I'm going to go and I'm just going to bump this just a tiny bit so we get that little bit of a, of a vignette there. Uh, make my pin point towards the middle more a little bit more round so we get more of his head in there without it cutting him and then just fade it all the way out get rid of all the the highlights you can any highlighted sections around the, the edges you can actually get rid of by bumping the highlights of this up so it doesn't affect those highlights um, and that's the uh, the crop uh, the vignetting tool which is really nice anyway so that we basically went from uh, this image to this image uh, with those few steps and um, you can kind of mess with little things like if you want it to be more yellow or more blue or whatever you want it to do you can kind of mess with it. Um, I like right around 9000 because it's neutral. So uh, not neutral but uh, just not super uh, crazy over the top yellow. Anyways, thank you for watching this tutorial. Uh, rate, comment, and subscribe. Talk to you soon.